Let's run you through the mid-cap movers. Um, Vivek is joining us, and he's going to talk about all the mid-caps which are in action today. Well, good afternoon. You know, like you mentioned, you know, on the back of the fact uh, that we have the Defence Expo going on, a lot of the Defence stocks are in focus. So, one that we have on our radar is Mazgao. Now, the company has actually uh, gone ahead and signed multiple accords at this particular Defence Expo. And on the back of that, you know, the stock is gaining on very strong volumes in today's trading session. The other stock on our radar is the Electronic Smart. Now, this is a recent listing, you know, up for the third trade session. Yesterday, we also saw some fund action here. And even today, first on the upper circuit. So if you've actually got uh, allotted, you know, IPO shares in this particular stock, you're already up 76%. Uh, the other one, of course, is Aegis Logistics. Now, this particular stock saw multiple block deals today, and after that, the stock has surged significantly on very strong volumes as well. Uh, some of the other stocks that we are tracking and stocks which are at fresh 52-week highs today, uh, BLS International, you know, stock has gained for five out of the last six trading sessions, and in the last six sessions, it's up almost 18%. Uh, also, Midani, now, you know, there was a news article that mentioned that the company is looking at collaborating with Boeing India for some aerospace parts. And on the back of that, again, you know, this particular stock is uh, perched at a fresh 52-week high. Apar Industries, you know, another stock, you know, not highlighted much, but this stock is gained for the last five trading sessions up almost 12%. And MAS Financial, Mass Financial too, uh, perched at a fresh 52-week high today. On the other hand, you know, some of the losers that we are looking at, Alembic Pharma, you know, this particular stock has fallen for nine straight sessions at a fresh 52-week low today. Uh, the US FDA inspected the Penela facility recently and issued four observations, but the stock clearly underperforming. SunTech Realty 2 today at a fresh 52-week low, and Astral today is falling on strong volumes as well. All right, okay, Vivek, thank you so much for bringing that list.